Our next guest uh, stars, oh, the people have been looking forward to this uh, movie. Uh, it's called Thor. Mm -hmm. Thor. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, I'm, I'm Thor. Well, me, me too. Uh, bring in the, the powder. You crazy nut. What? Where did you hear a thing like I that? I don't know where I heard that. Ladies and gentlemen, here's the star of the movie, uh, Chris uh, Hemsworth, everybody. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, you're from Australia. Uh, uh, and, and how did you work your way to the United... How did you get the Thor, uh, if you're from Australia? Thor is not uh, Australian <laughs> originally, is he? He's not, no, no. It was... Uh, I moved to the States about five years ago. And uh, about a year and a half ago, uh, I had a series of auditions like any other, and... And got the part. Wow. You, you know, you, you sound like you're from Australia. Yeah. I've got the accent. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you sound like... Are you, are you from the same part of Australia the, the Russell Crowe is from? Because it sounds similar. Uh, no. I, I don't know. I actually grew up in the, in the outback in Northern Territory. Um, what, what is it? The outback is not in a city. It's in the... the... No, it's way, way... About four and a half hours from the nearest city, actually. We lived in... A, in an Aboriginal community. Oh, uh, is that right? Cattle station. And, and how did you and your family uh, find yourselves there? My auntie and uncle worked on the cattle station, and then my parents went and worked with them, and we as kids went up and, you know, ran amok, and there were buffalo and, and, and crocodiles and what have you, and it was... So, so as a kid, that's where you and your brothers uh, yeah, were two, raised? Two brothers, yeah, Wow. We're back it... and forth from, from Melbourne and Northern mm -hmm. Territory. But it must have been... Is it safe for kids running around out there in the wild? Because uh... I know there's, there's, like, deadly stuff in Australia. There is, yeah. I mean, there's, I think, seven of the top deadliest snakes up there, and uh, every morning the, the concrete step out the front of our house, the... Uh, it would be the warmest spot. It would heat up during the daytime and through the night, snakes would come and, and sit on that to get some warmth. So in the morning, you had to look carefully at the step and make sure there wasn't a, a king brown or a red belly black snake or Oh, my something. God. But, f but for, a, for a kid, is, is, that, is that safe? Did you ever get bitten or anything? I didn't. No, no. We, we certainly had uh, some close calls and some stick poking of the snake, which we shouldn't have been doing. Right. Um, <laughs> My, uh, my older brother actually uh, he chewed on a scorpion one time. He was uh, chewing on something, and my mum said, well, what have you got? And a big old scorpion in his mouth, and he survived. So I think it was... Uh... How did it get in, in his mouth? He just picked it up. He's hungry, I think. And just like it. <laughs> wow. Just, uh... My goodness. <laughs> Uh, and now you're in, uh, married and living in Los Angeles. Have yeah, I heard about those yeah, two things? Yeah. And, and uh, what kind of things do you do there? Do you surf? Do you, you hike? You look around? I do, around? Yeah. yeah. You know, I try and stay outdoors and stay active as much as I can and, and uh, surf a lot. I've been surfing for years. We actually, another place we lived was Phillip Island in, in Victoria. And it was, uh, big, uh, it was a big seal colony there and a lot of big sharks that... Uh, that feed, feed on the, the seals. Things. Yeah. Now, when you said Phillip Island, where, where on the off the coast would that be? Uh, coastal Victoria, about an hour and a half out of Melbourne, and there's like a half mile bridge. Uh -huh. that and, and it's in what body of water? Uh, Victoria, off the coast of Victoria. Yeah. Is it near the Indian Ocean? Uh, I guess so. I don't yeah. know what's a, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I should look at a map or it's something. The, it's the I? Indian Ocean, and you should have known that. <laughs> I should have known that. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I'm there, you know. I, I need to. I didn't turn up to school. No, no, much. come on. <laughs> Listen. Um, the Phillip Islands water. Well, that, that, that surfing, that's uh, Australian surfers. They are the guys that really changed the surfing when they went to Hawaii, you know, in the sure. 70s and so forth. It's uh, a touchy subject, too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, and when and, uh, you were a kid, we didn't learn to surf? Yeah, yeah. We grew up down back and forth from the coast, and then we lived in Northern Territory where there wasn't any surf. And, and it was back, back, in, uh, back in Melbourne, but... Uh, sounds ideal for a kid to me, you know? It was great, absolutely. Yeah. We travelled a lot, you know, and, and saw a lot of, a lot of Australia, and uh, it, I think it taught me more about, you know, when, life uh, than and, school. Uh, and when did you start acting? Uh, when I finished high school, you know, I loved storytelling, I loved films and fantasy sort of books and things, and I never thought consciously about getting into it, and then my older brother was doing it, and I thought, this looks like fun, I'll give it a go, and, yeah. and then... Got, got, got lucky. And now, has, has your older brother also come to the States and is acting? No, my younger brother's here. Yeah. My older brother's uh, back home. Mm. So the whole family really is involved in Yeah, yeah. Uh, my mum actually, the audition for Thor, uh, she read Anthony Hopkins' lines and held the camera and did a great performance. And wow. I said to Anthony, you know, should, my mum did it a bit different. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, the story of uh, Thor, he's the god of uh, thunder, is yeah, that right? Yeah, yeah. And, and uh, what, what other responsibilities does he have? 
He, uh, <laughs> he's, he's, the, he's the prince of the nine realms and is about to take on the throne and of Asgard, which is called Otherworld. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's quite obnoxious and, and, and powerful and arrogant and controls the storms yeah. and has a big magic hammer. And, and is... <laughs> <laughs> No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He, it, it, it ain't that big. Because, um, uh, Chris, let's see a, uh, it, uh, this is uh, like a, a big uh, blockbuster of uh, fantasy, odyssey, adventure. It is, yeah. Special a, effects kind of thing. It is. One of Marvel's, uh, their next big franchise and a uh, blend of sort of science fiction, Viking-esque, and then it, it's earthbound as well. And mm -hmm. a yeah, big summer. I, 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 I want to talk uh, that way. <laughs> and if I talk that way, they, they wouldn't consider me, you know, just... I, I, I respect you. A lightweight pretty boy. They would think of me as... <laughs> um, let's see a clip here. What are we going to see, uh, Chris? This clip is uh, Thor has uh, been banished to Earth, and... Uh, He's had a big argument with his father and reignited an ancient war. Mm -hmm. And this clip, he, uh, he's actually been knocked out because he's now in human form. Oh, right. And uh, he's in the hospital and uh, doesn't appreciate... Oh, so people don't know, mortals don't know that he's Thor. They don't know. They have no idea. They yeah. think he's mad. And then uh, he decides to let him know. Take a look here. Now, Thor... Now, cut that out, Thor. <laughs> <laughs> We're just trying to help, for God's sakes. Wow, that's exciting. And you, and you shot a lot of it in uh, New Mexico. Yes. Yeah, it's beautiful there. Yep. Well, we'll look Santa forward Fly to this. New Mexico, uh, yeah. Opens uh, May 6th. Here's Thor, ladies and gentlemen. Chris Hemsworth, nice meeting you. Thank you. Good you luck to you. Thank, Thank you very much, sir. On May 6th, the summer's biggest 3D adventure begins when Thor, the Norse god of thunder, is betrayed. You are a vain, greedy, cruel boy. I cast you out! He is banished to the most depressing place on Earth. Let him. Oh, me. Thor. Now play. That's Thor why I ought to.